out here. How you doing? <laughs> it's been a while. I hope everybody's doing well. Hope you're drinking something good right now. But if not, I've got something I want to share with you. Check this out. I made my own light box out of an old cardboard box here. And I spray painted the, spray painted the interior white so that I can get some really nice high-end bottle shots. Uh, mostly when I'm working with this importer and distributor that I work with named Tom, Tom to share. Uh, I like his wines a lot, and that's really what I wanted to share with you tonight. Check this out. Uh, this here, this is a Petit Verdot. You may not have ever heard of that wine before. Uh, it's actually a grape. It's a red grape. And the reason why is because for centuries it was used as a blending grape in some of the finest Bordeaux wines out there, but not usually on its own as a wine like this. Um, it's got a lot of uh, bold kind of like floral characters to it. It's strong in tannins. It tends to be high alcohol, but it's a tough grape to work with. And for that reason, most winemakers don't really want to mess with it. Um, the winemakers of Bordeaux in France use this as a blending grape to beef up some of their uh, Cabernet Sauvignon and Merlot based wines. Just in the past 10 years or so, maybe, it's fallen back into fashion as a single varietal wine, which means made from 100% Petit Verdot. So you're going to start to see this popping up now, oftentimes from California. And this one here is uh, from Washington. This is one of Tom Deshare's wines. Uh, I really like this one a lot. Core Cellars. Core, by the way, the Latin word for heart. I think this wine's got a lot of heart. You might want to check it out. If you live in the state of Pennsylvania, you'll be able to find it. If not, you will be able to find other types of Petit Verdot. I really like to get people to try new grapes, things that they haven't had before. I'd like for you to try this if you can get your hands on it and let me know what brand you got and also what you thought of the wine. So uh, there it is, Petit Verdot, my quick recommendation for the week. Check it out, guys. And do me a favor, please, of course, share your thoughts and comments below. And uh, if you want to see some more of my videos, go to my YouTube channel, share with your friends, and also subscribe if you haven't already. Take care of yourselves and don't forget to drink something tasty. Cheers.